Candace. Anyone in this room can take one look at you, at how beautiful you are, and they can understand what attracted me to you. What can't be seen, though, is your caring heart, your supportive soul, your unbelievable strength and resolve. Your beauty is what attracted me to you. It's your character that made me fall in love with you, though. I know I'm with someone that will always be by my side during the highs and lows in life. I know I'm with someone who will always be there for me in whatever capacity is needed. Someone who I know will love me just as much today as she does in 50 years. I typically wouldn't have never glanced twice at a guy wearing a backwards hat, or Jordans for that matter. But there was something about you that had me hoping I could somehow spark your attention. One thing that drew me over to you over and over was that you were always a man. Not one day it went by that you weren't a sincere gentleman, and I loved that about you. I did then and I still do today. Today I'm honored to tell you that I love you and that I want to share the rest of my life with you. And as I stand here today with you, I can't help but think back at the beginning when you walked into the same Rod Ripple bar and sat down behind me. It didn't take very long before we were all sitting at a table together, having a small talk and sharing laughs. I had a great evening, but never thought our paths would cross again. When I arrived home that night, I was quite surprised to look at my phone and see a missed call from you at four in the morning. I guess that's when you found out that this city sleeps at night. Today and every day for the rest of our lives, I promise to believe in us. I promise to dream with you, celebrate with you, and be with, by your side for whatever we must prevail through. I promise to never forget that this is a once in a lifetime love and to always know in the deepest part of my soul that no matter what challenges might carry us apart, that we will always find our way back to each other. Today I choose you for the rest of my life. You make me the happiest woman on earth and I can't wait to turn around and start the rest of our lives together. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. It's an honor for me and it's a privilege to get to know Brian over the years because there's one thing about this amazing bride next to you is that she loves, she commits, and she gives her heart wholeheartedly when she trusts the person that's next to her. And all I can say is wish you guys a whole lifetime of love and just remember to always look up and you guys have a family that's supporting you guys through the rest of your lives. We couldn't be happier to have Candace come into our family. Probably the best thing that ever happened was five years ago, Geico transferred Brian to Indianapolis. Uh, otherwise, they would have never met. And we're thankful to Geico for that also because it gave us Candace, who we, we love very much. You two are truly the type of couple that people want to become someday because your love is so genuine. I knew right away that she was a good girl for Brian, right? She's smart, she's beautiful, she's very patient. <laughs> I just want to say 
you know, as a, a friend, you are very dear to me. You're a great guy. Candace, thank you for making him happy. And he's got a great future with you. So with my entire heart and soul, I take you as my wife, the mother of my child, and my soulmate. I promise to make things right, be committed enough to make our love strong and honest to keep it pure. This is a once-in-a-lifetime love. 